Hi guys, my name is Andrew Dali, the Bazooka Prophet. And today we are going to be taking a good example of a question on balancing of readers in a basic medium or alkaline medium. They both need the same thing. So I will be giving you the steps in which we are going to be using in solving the questions as I solve it on the board. Now the question says, balance the readout equation in basic or alkaline medium. And this is the equation or the reaction right here on the board. Now the first step that we're going to do is to break it into oxidation and reduction. Into half reduction and half oxidation. The making of the ion electron method. That is the method we are making use of in this case, the ion electron method. Put it in your mind that in solving or in the balancing of readers equation in the kinds of medium which are the basic and acidic medium, it is not difficult. So as we solve here, now first of all is to is to assign oxidation state to them. And by so doing, you rewrite them by saying, yeah, okay, the state here is minus 1 plus MnO4. Minus. Now, the oxidation state of manganese in this, uh, in this uh, compound or in this ionic compound is plus 7. And if you want to ask, how do I know? And, and the valency or the state of oxygen is minus 2. So minus 2 times 4 is minus 8. That is minus 8 is equal to the charge which is minus 1. So therefore, M N is equal to 8. That's plus 8 now. Okay, let's say minus 1 plus 8 is 18. Give me plus 7. So here is plus 7 for the manganese. Now we move there to the product MnO2. Now take note here eh, that the oxidation state of manganese in this oxide is plus 4. Why? Right? Minus 2 times 2 is minus 4. When it crosses the equality side, it turns to what? Plus 4. Now, plus this one here, yeah, this one we are find 0. That is the first step. We are going to apply. Now, we break it. Now, from minus 1 to 0 is oxidation, which means increase in oxidation number. So, we break it here is minus 1. That's minus 1. Here is oxidation. Now, we balance it as I've told you before. Now, um, we balance it both atomically and what? Ionically. Get that fast straight. We balance it atomically and ionically or electrically. Now, atomically now, we are having one atom of iodine and we are having two atoms of iodine. So, to balance this one here, there becomes two more here. Yeah? Now, in terms of charge, take note, I'm having minus two here and I'm having zero here. Zero here. So, remember I have told you that for all the addition Half, for half of the addition, that the that we use electrons to balance it, and that for the addition it is balanced at the right hand side. So it means I'm having here minus two here, and I'm having here zero. So I have to put plus two e minus so minus two minus two. This one is now balanced. This is for of the addition. Then we then move to what we have here for two, which is this one. This is the major aspect. Remember. It is in a basic or alkaline medium. So that will tell you that hydroxide ion will be added and also be at the final step, although not in all cases, but in most cases, that is how it is done. Follow my step. So we move straight down here. And here I'm having NnO4 minus. I'm having, yeah, okay. Now please follow me. Manganese here is one. Manganese here too is also one. Oxygen here is four. Ah, the oxygen atom here is four. Here is two. So if I'm having four here, I'm having two here. It means I will 
need two to put in this side that will make here and here will be equal. And in balancing of oxygen, we add water. So if I'm having to, I will need two years, so I'll have to add plus two H2O. Please follow me. Now, two times two, yeah, for, remember for every hydrogen atom, I will use hydrogen ion. So two times two is four. So I'll be having that's four hydrogen ion here. Now, that is the difference between the acidic medium balancing of freedoms to the basic uh, uh, to the basic medium balancing of freedoms. In which in the case of, uh, of basic, I will have to add equal number of hydroxide ion. Of this hydrogen ion to both sides. So we're having four hydrogen ion here. I'll be, I'll be having I'll be having four hydroxide ion to both sides. So that in the long run, four hydrogen ion to four hydrogen ion, we both of them are added together to give me four molecules of water. As is probably that I'm having five here, I'm not having five here. So five and five. Will be five H two O. So now I'm having four here. I'm having four, here. so here we come four H two O plus N N O four minus. Okay, I'm having N N O two plus two H two O plus four O H minus. Now we move. Now remember, I'm having four H two O here. I'm having two H two O here. Something can be removed from them. It's just like 4 minus 2. So if 4 minus 2, it means this one will have to go away. This one will be reduced to what now? To 2. Please take note. Take note. So I cannot comfortably clean this one away. Please follow. Please follow. So I'm not in this one away. So we then move. Then I will now rewrite this one to be four, eight, four, okay. So now be to be closer. Now what do I do next? Now please follow suit. Follow suit. Now atomically they are now balanced. Now the issue now is not the, the electric charges. Yeah. What, what I hear is zero. No charge was a molecule. Zero. Here I want to minus. One here, so meaning here is minus one, meaning everything here is minus one. But everything here is minus four, but here is zero, here is minus four. This four is affecting here, so four uh, minus four. Now, the last step. Now, to do it, it means that remember that for if for oxidation, I have to add to the right hand side, then for reduction, I will have to add to the left hand side. So if I'm having minus 4 here, I'm having minus 1 here, it means I will have to add theory, minus theory electron here, you see now, to give all together minus 4, to give all together minus 4, so that minus, minus theory, minus 1, I'll give it minus 4, equal to this one now, minus 4. Now, the last step is this, I will not combine both together, and to combine it together, I know that if here is minus 2, and here is minus T. The same rule we apply in that of acidic medium. We have to cross multiply. And in this T, we multiply everything that is here. While these two, we multiply everything that is here to give me the final step. So here will be times T. Here will be times one and two. So that, at, so at, so that at the end of it, the electron for both the oxidation and reduction will be equal. So let's go. Then we go six. Are you that I know? Tiri, are you the molecule? Plus six. Then I move here, here will give me four H2O plus two MNO4 minus plus, okay, six electron. You can see now, you have having two MNO2 plus. 8OH minus. Now, what do I do next? I will cancel both sides. So, so the electron will cancel on both sides of the half and the, the, the half reduction and oxidation. I cannot add them together comfortably without stress. 
So here becomes 6, yes, plus 4H2O plus 2MNO4 minus, okay, theory IOD molecule plus 2MNO2 plus 8OH minus. That is it. That gives us the balanced redox reaction. Redox reaction, as you can see right here on the board. Very easy. You can watch this video again to understand the steps. And for any question, you can always WhatsApp me on this line. On this line, okay, let me make it smaller. So, and also follow me on my YouTube channel to be getting updates and notifications. For now, God bless you.